Andy for his many contributions to UUFA, Native Red Buckeyes. Oh, oh yeah, great. <laughs> Had almost perfect attendance <laughs> in those 45 years, so raised the bar pretty high. And he looks up, too. <laughs> he looks up. <laughs> he looks up. And um, some of you may know that Larry is a fan of parody songs, right? And you may have seen his Elvis impersonation in the past. So we couldn't go without celebrating Larry in a little bit of song. So if I have a couple of folks who would be backup singers, but you have to stand far away from each other, backup singers. Cookie, I know you're one. Uh -uh. Oh, you have a blue choir without you. Oh, you be so blue singing without you. The back Bases will pine. Oh. Ooh, greet new members and help keep Stu in <laughs> And when we see songs in Swahili, <laughs> that's when we'll see. <laughs> we all know you must go up to old Ohio, but we'll have a blue, 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 blue choir. <laughs> yes, we'll have a blue. Award. To Larry Dendy for 45 years of dedication, love, and song in the UUFA choir. Thank you, Larry. Oh, I actually am, but I have been a member of the fellowship for 45 years. This is actually 2021 is actually the 40th anniversary of the choir. The choir was started in 1981, and you all have, some of you have heard this story before, uh, about how in the old building over on Prince Avenue, one night after potluck, Stu stood up, leave it to Stu, <laughs> stood up and said, anybody interested in joining the choir, come on up after the, after the potluck, and I'll talk about it. And actually, Stu and a few of us had sort of been talking about this just casually, but Stu took the, the lead and stood up and uh, said that, and I don't know what, eight or ten of us showed up that night. And uh, I think that Stu and I are the only remaining from that original group who are still active in the choir. Uh, but some of you came along soon after that. I know Elizabeth came in soon after that. Oh, I was um, there Wow. Yes. Um, and some some of the others of you came on along over the years. Um, Stu and I have, um, I think, had this kind of silent little contest going on about who would be the oldest living member of the choir. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Stu, I guess you're going to win. <laughs> <laughs>
Cause and you're not going to catch up with me, I don't think. <laughs> I tell you though, um, you know, I'm I'm old and looking around, and, um, I may be one of the older people here, but um, just goes to show you, if you hang around long enough, somebody finally takes notice of you. <laughs> Pays attention to you, so Stu. You, 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 you may get something like this. Year. Of course, you have to move off 500 miles for anybody to do it. But. My wife will probably like that. <laughs> um, but gosh, it, there, there's so many memories, and so it's been such a, a wonderful experience to be in the choir. And and really, I'm, you know, it's it's just amazing that someone like me who uh, cannot read a note of music and it's not Amber's fault, it's my fault because Amber has given me many opportunities to be able to be a better reader, music reader and better singer and I'm not, I'm taking advantage of all of those but you know somebody like me who's just a, a mediocre singer but who loves music and loves to sing has had the opportunity for 40 years to be involved with, with such a group and to be able to enjoy music and to have this creative opportunity. It, it really is just amazing and so I'm, I'm so grateful. Um, and I have to, you know, bless Amber. Um, Amber is a saint. She, she yeah. really is. She, she is. Really is. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. I, I don't, think there's a mean body, a bone in her body. Uh -uh. I can't think of a time in 40 years where she's ever spoken <laughs> harshly or, you know, reprimanded us or nothing but encouragement and approval and satisfaction and applause for us. And so Amber, I'm just so grateful to you for, for being our leader for 20 years uh -huh. and for all you meant to all of us and in particular to me and uh, thank you so much mm -hmm. uh, i have to um <laughs> have to give a nod to my old pal cookie here mm -hmm. uh, my, my fellow shepherd when we were back doing in the shepherd days we we did have a, a lot of fun planning those choir parties mm -hmm. and pool parties and that sort of thing and uh, cookie and i have had a wonderful friendship for many years Something you may not know about Cookie, we, we actually have a uh, relationship apart from the choir. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> this, this is a good thing, actually. Uh, you know, I don't know if you know it or not, Cookie is a real football fan, uh, particularly college football. And so for the past, what, at least 15, maybe longer Jeez. than that, years, Cookie and I have gone to a Georgia football game every every year, um, at least one every year for the past 15 or more years. And uh, it's always been great fun to be with Cookie, uh, not only at the football games, but in all of the things we've done together. So Cookie, you're, you're my prize in the world. Oh. It has been fun. Uh, we, uh, the basses and the tenors, have you know had this little back and forth over the years, and it's always been in fun for her. So we didn't we didn't mean anything cruel. <laughs> <laughs> even, even if you guys sing in a way that we just can't understand. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I, I really appreciate the Carl Priest reference because. Carl was, um, you know, just just the epitome of a bass voice. I've always stood beside Stu because Stu knows what he's doing. He can read music and he can hit the notes and he can sing. And I always figured if I could, you know, come close to what Stu was doing, I'd be okay. I could get by. But Carl was just intimidating. I mean, I, I didn't want to stand behind or beside him because I knew I could never. Uh, do what he did, and in fact, I think I kind of threw him off. So. <laughs> but for everybody else, it was not so bad. <coughs> anyway, I, I just thank you all so much for your friendship and for your love and companionship, and for being part so much an important part of my life for so many years. And, and, and thank you for doing this tonight. I'm just very, very grateful. We love you, Larry. <laughs>